My Koro Koro people are great on our according to your time. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Yes, we are here again with this matter that is trending. Finally, Mr. Obasi has surfaced. He has acted like a man. He has done what men are supposed to do. You know, from all indication, Mr. Obasi is not a talking type. All these things have been happening, but he hasn't taken any actions. Or the fact that he doesn't have money, he was suppressed. But thank God for the internet that has made everything, you know, open. His eyes have opened, guys. Because based on the fact that a lot of people have been talking on this thing, he also is also on social media. And he has been hearing all those the things people have been narrating. And now he has come to realize himself, guys. You all know that Mr. Obasi got married to Judy Austin. He sponsored him her ah, in school. We even heard that he, he bribed her way into the university, even though she didn't finish. This man has done what a good husband was supposed to do to his wife. But a lesson to be learned here, I've always been saying this. Men that send their wife to school when they themselves are not educated, it, there is high risk that those women will not stay with them for long. You are not educated and you are sponsoring a woman to school. So you know the value of education. Are you yourself didn't go to school? I know there are certain, certain circumstances, but there's adult education that if you think there's uh, importance of going to school, you should go to school. There's no limited time of someone to go to school. Now, because what I'm saying this is that we have just few percentage of women that will be educated after their husband have sent them to school and they will still submit to those that same husband. We have just few. Majority of those women will, you know, look down on their husbands tomorrow, just the same way Judy Austin has done uh, to her husband. Now the man is asking for restitution. For what? He said everything that he has spent, every dime he has spent on Judy Austin, they have to pay it back. He even went as far as uh, telling people that he has to conduct a DNA test for the other two children Judy Austin gave, gave him. That he's not too sure if he's the father of those children. Same with Stadike because he's not living Stadike. That Stadike also has to take a DNA test. This thing is really serious. You know, to collect everything you spend on Judy Austin's head. Do you think Judy Austin will have the money to give you back everything you spent on her? Judy Austin was busy building mansion with Yule Doche. She doesn't have a dime. Even as we speak now, she doesn't have anything. Her movies are no longer selling. That's why she's doing giveaway every day on her platform, begging people to go and watch her movies, begging people to go and subscribe on her channel. That's how bad it is. The only thing he can fight here is fighting for his children. If he knows that he's the father of those children, he, he, he just have to do the needful by taking care of them. I will also advise him to do a DNA uh, to all the children because we don't know what is actually happening. Because if you can be in, a mar in your marriage and you are sleeping with another person until you are getting pregnant, the probability of the other ones not being your husband is high. It's high. I think that's the only thing Mr. Obasi has to do. But collecting money that you spend on a woman is being childish. No one asks you or no one forced you to sponsor a woman in school. So guys, that's the update I had for you people today. I really appreciate Bye for now.